Hey everybody, welcome back to Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. In the previous video, we had an awesome time going through the Jedi Temple over on Ilum. We started off in Dathomir and we had to escape from Dathomir because our lightsabers got destroyed. But now we are in the Jedi Temple, we are in the depths of the Crystal Caves, and we got our own Kyber Crystal. Is that what it's called? Kyber? I think it is. I think it is. And our new lightsaber has a special feature to it. So, first off, take a look at the color. Oh my god, this is so freaking awesome. You can put whatever color you want that is available on, uh, you know, this uh, crafting table here. But moreover, we have the single lightsaber, we have the dual lightsaber, and then we have the split saber. Look at this. It's so damn cool. It is so damn cool. Holy shit. Which also actually opens... Oh, uh, excuse me, excuse me, <laughs> sorry, I'm just getting a little bit excited and I'm stumbling over my words. It also opens us up to unlock the achievement, Blade Master, which requires you to hit a single enemy with all lightsaber types, which should be very straightforward, very easy, now that we've got all the lightsaber types. Alright, now that I've got all that out of the way, let's get going! Let's get going, now, now that we have our uh, lightsaber available to us, once again, we can start making our way through the area. Of course, let's meditate, save our spot. I bet you we're going to run into some enemies. We did hack the droids, but they're going to respawn, you know, since we're doing this. And uh, yeah, it's going to be exciting. I'm going to try and get the collectibles on our way out. And I don't know where we're headed next. Are we headed like back to Dathomir? Are we headed anywhere specific? I don't know. I guess we shall see. I do need to uh, get collectibles potentially on Zepho, so we may take care of that first. Oh boy, oh boy, uh, we're, we're getting in a fight right away. Alright, you know what, you know what, I might try it. Oh, Jesus. I don't know if I should try it right now. Let's, let's see, bam, alright, and then, and then, so, that one enemy right there, let's see if I can hit, hit them with it. Let's go, let's go, let's go, we can do it, we can do it. Oh yeah, hell yeah, oh my god, that's so damn cool. Jesus, yo! Oh my god, this is freaking awesome as hell. Alright, let, let's go, let's hit, hit with a single lightsaber. Oh, there we go, there we go. Ooh. Wow. Come on, get in here. Bam. Holy, dude. Get away from me. What I like is that the, the dual lightsaber does not require you to uh, use up any force. So you can use it, like, unlimited. An unlimited amount, which is freaking awesome. How many enemies are we going to deal with right now? What is going on? That was a freaking awesome-ass parry. What the hell? But seriously, what is going on with all the enemies? This is this is a ridiculous amount. Oh, damn. That killed a lot of them. Okay, let's see. Oh boy. All right, all right. Come on, come on, come on. Last, last one, last one. It's all you. Bam. Jeez, why was that so many? That's like more than I've ever faced. <laughs> that was crazy. All right, but the music was really hype during that entire fighting sequence. That was awesome. And it still is kind of hype. It still is kind of hype. Okay, let's see. Oh boy. Are those security droids? Okay, all right. So, wow, that's a lot of security droids. What the hell? Am I just supposed to run past them? I don't think I'm supposed to run past them. Okay, all right, you ready? Let's go. We're gonna hack one for sure. I wonder if I can hack two of them. Oh shit, oh shit. Yo, yo, chill everybody, chill. We're definitely gonna try and hack. Oh, is it like if I start attacking one? Like whenever I start attacking them, they, they then activate and start attacking me or is it like only two can oh yeah they all start attacking me so if i would just focused on a single one i would have been safe but now that i'm like focused on multiple enemies all at once it's a uh, it's to to the detriment of uh, my safety you know it's not a good thing it's not a smart thing i was hacked that one too we're just going to hack them all and they're all going to be our allies don't don't punch your ally i'm making him your friend and you're punching him that is not smart oh you know what i can do now that we're in this room and these enemies have a crap ton of health I'm gonna hit him with both lightsaber types. Oh, let's hack this one. So let's go to this one. We're gonna hit him with split lightsaber. We're gonna hit with, oh, chill. Did I not make this one my friend? What is going on? <laughs> We're gonna hit him with a single lightsaber. If I can hit the one on the right. Oh, I'm about to die, I'm about to die. Yo, 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 chill. Oh, hey, I got the achievement. Bam, I don't know why I got the achievement. I was missing that, uh, you know, trip double lightsaber, but hey. I got the achievement and I think that's all that matters. So that is the achievement Blade Master and we have earned our way. That was freaking awesome. Look at all these goddamn enemies. <laughs> oh, such a good execution. Damn, they're just like in a freaking tussle in, in just a group <laughs> fighting each other. That's so good. Holy, all right. Time to die. That was awesome. Hitting them all against each other. That was super cool. Are you looking at something? Where are you headed? 
You want to scan that? All right, you got it. Empire mining operation. It's hard to look at these crystals after everything we went through. Damn, that was a weird ass noise that uh, BD1 off. just made. Seer, we need to get out of here. They've taken over Ilum. Are you all right? No, they spotted me. And that's not all. They're mining kyber crystals. Captain, prepare for takeoff. Wow. That's crazy. They're mining kyber crystals. That's not good. So, I mean, like, I guess maybe it's just, like, not a legit thing that the kyber crystals choose you, but if they can mine it, they can, like, hone the power of it, right? Is that what you can, uh, assume? Oh, boy. All right, what shall I purchase? Howling push, howling pull, uh... How's maximum force? We're gonna increase our maximum force. That's good. I want some survivability stuff. Those those are very useful. Uh, what is this one over here? What is this ability? Whirlwind throw throws the double bladed lightsaber in an area around Cal. God damn, that is awesome. Okay, sweet. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna jump for sure. Bam! I think this is where the uh, door is that I couldn't access two seconds ago. Or maybe it's not. It's kind of hard to tell. Let's find out. Let's find out where it leads. Leads to a chest. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. Thank you, BD. Hey, and then... Whoa! Chill, everybody! Chill, guys. Chill, chill, chill. Bam. Sorry about it. Yeah, look at that. And I unlock it. Oh, what, what? Oh, we respawn them. We respawn them. We, oh, shit. Oh, shit. We respawn them. That's not good. <laughs> oh, boy. Wow. That was a bit scary. Okay, let me just go ahead and heal since, you know, we're at that meditation spot anyways. It's like we're just, you know, we went in a circle. Might as well. Might as well do that. Okay. All right, moving on. Let's do that. And then, bam. Okay, what shall I do? Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't know which direction we should be going after uh, leaving through that door. Because I don't actually know where we are. It looks like we're in, at the midway point. I can kind of recognize this area now. Whoa, sorry, dude. Bam. Whoa, chill. All right, come on, shoot me. Bam, let's go. Ooh, that was badass. Holy. Yeah, shoot me again. Bam, bam, you're dead. You're dead. All right. Uh, let's see. We ha we have a few things we got to take care of in terms of uh, in terms of collectibles. So let's get those done before we leave because we have we've only got one chest left and we've only got uh, one uh, secret left and I know where both of them are. So on our way back we're gonna get them and the last secret is all the way or no, the last chest is all the way at the entrance. So yeah, we're not we're not even gonna be wasting our time. We're just gonna grab it on our way out. Isn't that perfect? Love it when that happens. Oh geez, they got a rocket, eh? Are they gonna shoot it at me from that far? Oh, they are? No way. All right. Oh, <laughs> dude, you're kidding me. I guess I didn't see how fast it was going. Yeah, that was going pretty fast. <laughs> oh, God damn it! why did it happen again? It goes a lot faster than you think. I gotta be honest. All right, look, he's gonna shoot, and then this time I'm gonna get it. And bam, where'd it go? Oh, I thought it would like shoot directly at the stormtrooper. That's a shame. Where does this go? Oh, I don't want to go this way. I want to go back to the right side. Where does this bring me? Oh, it brings me the way I wanted to go. Perfect. That's lovely. All right, let's get let's get this secret then. So we're gonna go over to the left over here, and there's an area for us to destroy. Here, I remember the wonder of these caves. I couldn't wait to complete my training and become a Jedi Knight. That's all. All right, sorry for interrupting you, Cal. I was interested in what you had to say, but uh, these enemies, they, they were gonna see me. I had to. All right, where does this go? Jeez. Where, what the hell? Where are we going right now? Um, It, it doesn't feel like, because we have to go down. We have to go down to get to this secret, so. what? What is happening? Is this the wrong way? Like, is this the full-on exit? Let's see. Oh man, it could be. Where did we come out to? Oh, wait, no, it's the right way. Oh, look that, I guess it is the right way. That's crazy, okay, good. Perfect. I'm glad that worked out for me. <laughs> I'm cool with that. Okay, bam. 
and bam, and we're about to get uh, maybe four sessions. I don't know. I don't know what to expect over here. Let's see. We've got maximum life. Yes, and our maximum life has been increased. Holy, that's great. But master, this is easy. Oh, that's cute. Youngling pride. That's very cute. All right, sweet. God, what is going on with the music? It's super hype right now. It's just going off. And now it just stopped. <laughs> it's so weird. Okay, let's get up here, and I guess we're just headed out. Yeah, we got nowhere else to be. We're just headed out of the cave, and we're gonna head over to the chest once we make it out. But first, we have to make it out, right? We can't just step away. Okay. Oh, let's go! Come on! No, what? Whatever, all right, you're all dead. You guys are all dead. Oh, Jesus. All right, looks like I'm dead. God damn. God damn, chill, 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 everybody. Woo! Oh my god. Oh my god. Ooh, that could have been dangerous. Go, 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 go. Quick, quick, quick. Yeah, let's go. Oh my god, we got a purge trooper. Yo, everybody, everybody chill. <laughs> Yo, no thanks. All right, I'm gonna push all you guys off. Bam. Oh, I only pushed one. I want to push multiple, dude. What the? F oh. oh, oh. <laughs> Yo. All right, hold on. Let's get it. Let's get a perfect evade. No, that's not a perfect evade. I I need to slow the enemy, right? Bam. There we go. Yeah, that was so cool. If you get a perfect evade, you get a slow. And there's also an achievement for um getting a hundred perfect evades, I think, which is kind of bonkers because I never evade. Like I never just straight up evade. I'm always like doing the the roll to evade. I'm I'm never like doing the perfect evade if that makes sense because this this right is like a single click I didn't expect this guy to follow me but it's a single click the regular evade but the roll is a double click so it's uh it's not something I'm used to that's for sure oh Jesus these enemies are kind of uh ridiculous I'm about to die oh here comes a rocket oh my god oh all right I'm out of here these uh these purge troopers are not a good time that's for sure Holy, I can't believe I survived that too. God, the rockets are not making things easier, dude. Get out of here. Thank you very much. God damn. You're up Oof, these purge troopers, huh? God damn, you wanna come for me? You guys are trash. What about disguising the mantis's signal? That trick only works if they're not expecting it. I have another idea. Whoa, I'm holding the lightsaber? What the hell? I'm not allowed to use a lightsaber underwater. That's cool. <laughs> but I can't I can't do anything with it. <laughs> it just lights my way. I, I guess I like that. Okay, so I think this is the exit right over here. Oh man. Those those freaking enemies were tough. They, they were so difficult. There's no way you can just beat them. You have to run past them. I've sliced through their encryption. I'm scrambling transmissions, but it won't be long before they're restored. Hopefully it'll buy us some time. Thank you. There's stormtroopers everywhere. Oh, I don't know what she, uh, I interrupted her with a meditation. Sorry, Seer. Yeah, they said, she said Ilum was our planet. That's all I got from that. I didn't read the rest. That's my bad. Oh, Jesus. Okay, is this the, is this the new way out? Thanks for uh, building a way out for us. Okay, let's see if I can just run. Yeah, honestly, I can just run here. Ooh, look at this. Uh, let's find the wall. And called reinforcements. Every star destroyer in the sector is on their way here. If they get here before you do. No, we didn't come all this way to get captured. I'll be there. Yeah, I'll be there. I'll be in a rush after I get this collectible. Okay, Seer? Priorities. We're talking about priorities here. And that way we don't have to come back to the planet for anything, right? The only thing we would ever need to come back to this planet for, I think, is customizing the color of the lightsabers. Because no other uh, crafting table allows you to, to like, change the color of the lightsaber to this degree. To the to purple or any color you wanted, right? From the array that you could choose. No, uh... No other crafting table would allow that, as far as I know, so that's the only reason I could ever see coming here, but I'm pretty sure I'm sticking with purple for the rest of the game, because it's uh, by far my favorite. Okay, here we go. Oh, what are we going to examine? What do you want to examine? Is it the view? Definitely worth the climb. Oh, it is the when view. I saw it for the first time, I was almost as small as you. 
Wow. Not nearly as brave, though. Oh, that's so cute. That's so cute. It is a very nice view. Holy. Wow. Look at that. All right, bam. So I believe... Let's check the map. That is five out of five chests. That is three out of three secrets. And we didn't explore everywhere. It says 98% explored, but I'm not about to start searching freaking all over the place. The exploration doesn't matter anymore. What matters is um, the chests and stuff. So I'm pretty good with uh, leaving now. All right, let's drop. And bam. All right, let's drop. And bam. All right, let's drop. Bam. Nicely done. That was quick. It was way faster on the way down. Oh boy, who are we going to fight? Are we going to fight anybody on the way to the Mantis? What do you guys think? I don't know what to expect. Oh boy. Oh, See I here. hear something. We've got company. Tell Grease yep. to close the Mantis. What? With the Empire on your tail? Are you crazy, kid? Trust me. We do. We'll close the ship. Okay, wow. So I have to fight this then? That's what it's telling me? I have to fight this thing? Alright, I guess I'll slow it and get going. Come on, come on. Oh, did it drop a grenade? Yo, buddy, chill. We got two of them. Yo, that's not good. <laughs> it's okay. They're not too hard after all. They're, they're kind of easy, these enemies, if I'm being honest. The first time I, I ran upon them, I didn't even know you could slice their legs. So that's the only issue I had fighting them last time. Now it's it's a cakewalk. It is definitely a cakewalk. Okay, uh, let's slow. Let's freaking push this one. Like, dude, frick off. Oh, do I, do I need to do a heavy push? Maybe I do. God damn, that was crazy. What was what was going on there? Bam. Yeah, I can push it. Sweet. But it has to be a heavy push, like I thought. Alright, chill, 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 chill. Alright, let's go. Oh, that was a waste of a freaking force attack. I can't believe I missed. God damn. Oh, did someone jump out of the AT ATST? I, I forgot that happens. Oh shit. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We're almost there. Alright, you know what? Screw you, dude. I'm gonna kill you. And then we're gonna kill you. Oh, damn, that was scary. All right, let's slow you, let's slow you. Oh, look at that, did you see the blaster bolt? It got slowed, god damn. I didn't know that could happen. All right. Whoa, okay, let me heal, let me heal. Holy. Okay, bam, look at that. I think that might be an achievement. Cause I know there's an achievement for hitting someone with the, their own blaster bolt that has been slowed. Hold on, I didn't know you could do that. Ooh, we might also be getting another achievement in this video. That's freaking awesome. All right. Yo, buddy, this guy needs to die. This guy needs to die. So I have to focus the limb just like uh, Gorgara. Oh! <laughs> they died at the perfect time, holy. All right, where's this enemy at? Oh yeah, shoot me, shoot me. Uh, Wait, wait, hold on, I need to... Uh, oh, sorry, dude. <laughs> I needed to uh, get some force, but... I ended up killing them by accident. That's my mistake. Whoopsie daisy. All right, let's go on the Mantis. They closed it. Yeah, they closed the ship. But are they going to open it for me now that I arrived? Thank you very much. We did. I wouldn't be here without all of you. I used to sit on Baraka dreaming about storming Coruscant with survivors from the Jedi Council. Instead, the Order's hopes rest on a gambler, a fallen Jedi, and a failed Padawan. A bunch of screw-ups. You can say that again. It is the only reliable one. He let Cordova wipe his memory so he could stay behind and guide us. But you're both willing to sacrifice everything. To keep going even when it seems impossible. Failure's a part of the journey. I get that now. Thank you. All of you. Wow. All right. Let's talk to him. Let's see what's up. Let's talk later, Cal. Oh, okay. Let's talk to him. Not now. I got work to do. Okay, I got it. I get it. Okay, chill. All right, so okay. where shall we head? Okay, um, so yeah, the objective is on Dathomir, right? But I think I'll head to Zepho and start some collectible hunting because I need to get collectibles, you know? I only have 20 chests left and I have, uh, is that nine? Yeah, I have nine secrets left. I think I might not collect all of it, but I'll, I'll try my best to do as much as I can over here. And then, you know, I, I'm on a timeline myself right now, so I don't want to make this video super, super long. But I do want to crush Zepho. So let's head over there. Let's travel to that planet. Hey, guys. Um, I just uh, I just want to say there are a ton of collectibles that I get in the video. Like, we take a lot of time to get from point to point in this video. So you can see probably by the length of this video that there is a lot that you can expect in terms of busy work and all that stuff. 
So what I've done for this video, I don't normally do it for uh, my Let's Complete series anymore, but what I've done is I've gone ahead and put time codes so you can jump around to the relevant points of the video if you want to check out like, you know, specific story beats or maybe get the collectible mop up even if you're interested in that. So take advantage of those. Those are there for you to use. All right. Anyways, sorry for the interruption. Enjoy the rest of the video. All right. Oh, oh my God. You know what I just... I, I'm looking at an achievement that says complete all of BD1's hollow maps. I think I might actually need to explore every single planet. Damn it. I think I just realized that. There's an achievement called A Galaxy Far, Far Away where it says complete all of BD1's hollow maps. And I think that means I need to go back to Illum at some point. Oh boy. How annoying, huh? Okay. All right. So we are going to start searching through Zepho. We are going to start collecting the chests and secrets. So I'm going to get to it. Uh, hopefully I locate an enemy that can shoot me and we're gonna try for that Achievement that I mentioned earlier where it was a slowed blaster bolt So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in two seconds once we get to the next, uh, you know event that takes place Who knows what it'll be? All right. See you in two seconds. Okay. Let's see. I think I found the secret right over here Did I find one? Where does this lead? What the hell? Where am I? What's going on? Do I climb this? Oh, look at that. I did find a secret. Oh! Is it more? Oh, hell yeah. Oh my god, hell yeah. That's so awesome. You're a lifesaver. You know that? Looking good, buddy. Wow, holy crap. So now I'm at six uh, stims. Six stims in my inventory. Holy crap. That's awesome. And that was a secret. That right there was a secret. Alright, sweet. It was right over here. Alright. Let's head over to the next one. That's awesome. I also located a force essence for those who want to listen to it. We'll listen to it now while we're headed out of this cave. The mother used this fabric to keep her child warm. They were on the run from something. All right. Now let's see what's up next. What else are we going to find? Oh, what's BD1 scanning? Is this a is this a new plant? What is this? Oh, just a thing to scan. A warning. Interesting. I missed that on my first uh, run through this area. That's crazy. That's awesome. All right. Found another sense echo, which I'm surprised I didn't see before. Like, it's not that far out of the way. Take her and go. I'll lead them away. Ostar, no! Ostar and Mariana. Very interesting. Okay, now we are looking for a chest in this specific area. It could be a scompling chest that I just missed at some point, so let's run all the way to the end and see if it's the one I'm thinking of. Like, if it is scompling, it's this one right here. Oh, yeah, I think I see it. I think I see it. So, yeah, bam, we got another chest, and that would be this area fully searched now. We'll be done in here. And then we'll uh, continue on to our next location. Oh, boy. I also need to uh, still unlock that achievement for slowing down a blaster bolt. But I don't know how I'm going to do that, if I'm being honest. I have no clue, so I still got to think about that. I still got to think about that. Oh, that was a good kick. All right, let's move on to the next spot. Okay, BD1 is scanning something. All right, we're continuing up the hill. This is the something bluffs. It is the windmills in the Zepho area. And this is a path that I actually had never taken. Like, I didn't even know that there was a meditation spot right there. So this is a new path for me which is pretty awesome, which makes sense why BD1 is, uh, you know, scanning stuff, because I've never, never visited this area. And I think we should be coming across a secret very, very soon. I don't know uh, what kind of secret it is, but it's going to be a secret. Look at this. Oh, wow. It's some essence. Yeah, let's go. What kind of essence is it? What kind of essence we got? All right, let's see it. Life essence, hell yeah. Here by stormtroopers. He seemed anxious for some reason. Pressure to find relics. Okay. All right. Let's continue on. Let's get out of here. All right, here we go. We got a scompling for us to open up over here. Oh, wow. Look at this. And the scompling just has a chest inside of it. That's so funny. The door behind the scompling. It's not even just like a scompling chest. It's just a door that requires scompling. I think that's funny. Okay. All right. And we're missing one more chest in this area. Let's locate it. Oh, look at that. I found, I found the last chest I needed. And it's right below this uh, monument over here. That's pretty dope. Sweet. Come on, buddy. I didn't even know there would be a chest here. I honestly just fell down this way by accident. So that's pretty good. I'm glad I found that. All right. Now we are headed over to 
Uh, where is it? I guess we have to explore the rest of this area because we have it 95% explored. Oh boy. Okay, so we're, we're gonna do that. We're gonna explore that, but yeah, I don't need to show you guys exploration. What I am gonna show you is the next collectible, which is probably gonna be over in Augur Pulverizers. I think I know exactly where I need to be for that one. So yeah, I'll see you guys in two seconds. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Before I left, I found a terrarium seed <laughs> just right beside the chest. BD1 was waiting for me to scan it. That's so funny. It was just right over here. <laughs> okay, awesome. Nicely done, BD. Nicely done. Okay, so I think I've got it. I think I've got it here. I've got the next Force Essence. Bam. All right, sweet. Yeah, I've got I've got it right here. Life Essence, Force Essence, same thing. It's a secret, and I finally made it to it. Holy crap. That took me forever to figure out. I don't know why it was so difficult to figure out, but I finally got it. I just had to use my double jump ability. These Sweet. These workers lack proper leadership and motivation, which you cannot provide. You'll relieve it. Oh, wow. We haven't seen Officer Crane in a long time. Wow, that's crazy. Okay, so we fully explored Augur, Augur Pulverizers. Next up, where are we headed? I think we might be headed to the Windswept Ruins. It's been a long time since we've been there. Oh, I'm excited. It's been super long. Yeah, next destination, Windswept Ruins. Or is it Ancient Catacombs? Yeah, that's where we're headed. Ancient Catacombs it is. All right, see you guys in two seconds. All right, so we've got an air vent over here. I don't even know how the air vent initially started up. Maybe it was while we were in the uh, Tomb of Elram. But look, this is an area I have not been in before. And if I go up, I find the chest in the area. Bam, that's sweet. So, I think we fully explored these catacombs. That's pretty awesome. Yeah, fully explored. Look at that. That was an easy one to locate. All right, next up, we are headed over to the Windswept Ruins. We have a few spots that we could check out. Honestly, should not be an issue locating what we need in here. All right, let's go. All right, we made it to the Windswept Ruins, and I think I already see our chest over there. Oh, boy, we got a bounty hunter. We got two bounty hunters. Oh, Jesus. Um, okay. All right, uh, maybe I won't fight them. I might just meditate to see if I can get rid of them. <laughs> you know, I do not want to fight them. Getting a strange feeling from this one. Ancient Zepho gathered here. I wonder why. Okay, sweet. So we got a we got a sense echo or a force echo while we were, uh, you know, while we realized our mistake of running into these bounty hunters, and we still get to fight them. How fun! Gotta love it. Oh boy. Okay, um, let's see if I can avoid them. It looks like I'm not necessarily able to. Yeah, Mad Midge is on me. But can I just, like, not fight them? That'd be pretty cool. I saw the chest over here. I saw it, and I would like to just get my chest and go. <laughs> oh, it looks like I can actually just get my chest and go. That's awesome. You're not after anybody. You guys are stuck on the ground. Sweet. Oh my god, I thought I was screwed over here. All right, sweet. <laughs> we fully explored the windswept ruins. Oh, I'm glad I got to avoid them. All right, next up, we're headed to the tomb of Elram, I believe. Yes, we are. Let's see. Yeah, 88% explored. We're missing two items in there. Should be easy enough to find them all. I think at least. I think it should be. All right, let's get down there. Oh, BD1 is scanning a, f a flower before we go. Hell yeah. We got a terrarium seed, a gilly pod. A gilly pod? A gilly pod. Nicely done. All right, let's get down to the tomb. All right, I think we are coming up on uh, the doorway or pathway that contains something. Oh yeah, I remember this. We fought, oh Jesus, we got, oh yeah, we fought, <laughs> we fought that guardian over there. Oh boy, and how do we get through it now? Do we have to push this into it? No way, that's the solution. I probably could have done this on my first run through here. I can't believe that's the solution. I didn't know they had that kind of power that they could like destroy a wall like that. That's awesome. Zephyl crafted this artifact as an offering to the wind. It was destroyed intentionally for some reason. All right, sweet. All right, bam, that's a secret discovered. Now, if we take a peek at, oh, Jesus, chill, dude. Oh my God, oh my God. God damn. Yo, buddy, 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 let's not, let's not even fight. All right, now we can probably take a look at, uh, you know, actually, let's get out of here. Let's get out of that room before we start getting blown up by those spirit bombs. Okay, uh, now we have a 92% explored, uh, Zepho, or Tomb of Elram, I mean. And we are looking for just one final section, most likely, that contains our chest. So, I'll see you guys in a sec. I may end up looking up the, uh, final, you know, area that I cannot seem to locate, but 
We'll see if I can locate it myself. If I can't, I'll, I'll look up uh, an article location or I'll look up an article that contains the location and I'll let you guys know. I honestly probably will, if I'm being honest. All right, here we are. So I was struggling to find out where at all I could have uh, missed. And honestly, I should have thought about it right over here. I should have thought about this section right here. So in the description, I'm going to be putting a website that someone has uh, set up that compiles every single location or like every single map and like area in every planet of the game. So I'm going to be linking that in the description for you guys to check out. It's an awesome site. They run ads on the site. So if you even open up a page once, you'll, you know, sort of help them out. So I'd highly recommend that you just check out the site and, uh, you know, push, push some, you know, traffic towards that site. So that way they can get some uh, support through their ads. And, you know, I can give them credit for the assistance they've given me in uh, getting 100%. I'd highly recommend you check that out. It's a useful, useful site. Okay, now that we've done that, let's head over to the rope over here. I'm surprised I missed it. Yo, I, I didn't even take it in. So it was just over to the left. Wow, yeah, I fully missed it. Would you look at that? That's that's really well hidden, I gotta be honest. It's one of those things, uh, like, even though I was doing, I was being pretty thorough overall through the entirety of, uh, of the uh, game, like, this is one area that like I just straight up would have missed no matter what. That's awesome. We're scanning this pole over here. Okay. Wind chimes. Julio. Alright, Tomb of Elram, 96% explored. You're kidding me. Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna use that same um, website to find out where the last location is. But uh, we found everything we need. We basically found everything we need in the Tomb of Elram. So, when I see you guys next, we are probably going to... Let's see, we're gonna head over to the Ice Caves. All right, we have made it to the ice caves and we're going to cut this shortcut so that way uh, it's available. I don't know if this necessarily affects the uh, exploration percentage of an area, but, uh, you know, it's good to have that taken care of. And now let's go and take the vines. Oh, boy. Was I supposed to be able to reach them like better than that? I feel like I honestly was. What the hell? How do I get there? Is, is there a different route to take to arrive at that location? I don't know about that. What is this? Oh, was I honestly, I was honestly probably supposed to make it there from the Imperial Dig site. I'm getting knocked out. Goddamn, chill! Chill, chill, chill. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay, so we got another chest right over here. I think this is the final chest that I need. I don't know where my, uh, my final secret is. It could be across the vines, which I still don't understand if I'm supposed to be able to make it across. So let, let's see, let's see. So we're gonna, of course, collect this chest. That's great, we've got the chest, right? So that's good. And now, we should, like we should, it's 92% explored still. I think the secret is over here. It might be a stim, a stim crate, a stim box. I'm not too sure if uh, that's what I saw for sure. But I might give it one more try. I might give it one more try. I don't know if I can actually make it. I just don't know how. Maybe we take a look at the skills. See if it says anything about the skills, but, uh, I don't know. I just don't know. Okay, delay thrust. I'm missing, I'm honestly missing no skills. Lightsaber mastery, increases all lightsaber damage, blah, blah, blah. There's a double, double-sided lightsaber, double-bladed lightsaber. I mean, howling push, howling pull, uh, the power of friendship. Yeah, nothing, nothing here is indicating any skill that would potentially help me, uh, reach these vines. So... Am I supposed to be able to reach them from this side, or is it, is that not what's uh, supposed to happen? I don't know. I don't know. It's crazy. It's crazy how far it is. God, leave me alone. All right, we're gonna try one more time. All right, did we get it? Oh my god, we got it! What? It worked this time. Yo, no way. We made it. Oh, 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 oh. Wow. I'm surprised we made that. And we made it to a freaking stim crate. Let's go. That's another one. That's a freaking another stim crate. That's so awesome. Would you look at that? Man, I'm glad. I'm glad we managed to uh, clear out the ice caves. I I hope we cleared it out. Look at that. Another stim canister. That's great. That's so great. Oh, what is this? How do I get there? Oh, I think I found it. I found the next section to head into. I found the secret area, right? How do I get there? What? What the hell? Do I have to jump off? Okay, I think I got it. I think I got it. Hold on. Alright, let's overcharge. Oh, wait, wait. No, no, don't overcharge. Here. Alright, let's go back down this path here. I found it. Sweet. 
Okay, so let's overcharge. Bam. Let's go this way. Bam. Then let's go this way. And then once we get back down this way, you can see I have to jump off early. I got it. I got it. I got it. So here we go. Here we go. We got it. We got it. So if I jump off and I press B right about now, bam, look at that. That was freaking easy. Would you look at that? Oh, it only took forever. For me to find this spot. And it's a freaking stim canister spot? Yo, that is so awesome. That is awesome as hell. I was not expecting this. The stormtrooper used these while scouting the area. Looks like he may have found a way into the tomb. Holy crap, we found another stim canister. That is awesome. Oh my god, we have like eight stim canisters at this point. This is this is great. This is so good. Hell yeah. Yeah, BD1. We're we're so full of health. Love it, stim canister acquired. Holy crap. All right, so here we are. We are in the Imperial headquarters. Um, so in the previous recording session, this is a separate day that I am now recording. It took me like an hour and a half to uh, make this much progress. So I had to actually quit out of my previous recording session. But right now we are at the Imperial headquarters. We just finished the dig site, of course. And in the previous recording session, I completely forgot to speak during this portion of my recording. I collected a collectible right over here. This was an area that I had not yet explored because I needed to um, have scompling over here and I need to have force pull to activate the vines or the rope over here. So I actually um, just totally forgot to speak and I explored this area and I collect a sense echo that was in this location. I was like, oh my God, I can't believe I forgot that. But uh, yeah, that is totally my mistake. I'm going to be playing the audio from the sense echo right now for you guys to enjoy if you are interested. Um, yeah, and then from there, we are going to be continuing on. We are going to go down into the Tomb of Mictril after we collect the chest that is right in front of us. So enjoy the sense echo, and then we're going to go ahead and get started. An Imperial officer hit a valuable relic here. She's hoping to use it to gain favor with the Emperor, but her deception was making her reckless. All right, we're getting back into it. Sorry about, uh, you know, that hiccup, that that mistake that I made while uh, recording. That is my bad for sure. We're going to go ahead and collect this chest. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. We're going to collect this chest. And then we're going to head down into the Tomb of Mictril. And while we're headed down into the Tomb of Mictril, I'm actually going to take a look at uh, what we are missing. I think I actually did a very good job in exploring the tomb. So if we take a look, take a peek, we have 96% explored the uh, Tomb of Mictral. We are missing one chest and one secret. It looks like there is an area right there that I have not entered into, so maybe that is where we're going to head into, huh? Yeah, honestly, that's where I'm going to be heading straight towards. Uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in two seconds. That's where we're headed. I know there is a Force Essence or Life Essence in that area. I don't know where this final chest could be, so we definitely need to be vigilant on our way. So let's make our way over there. Oh boy, we went right into the... We went right into the bell. Oh, geez, or the chain, whatever you want to call it. All right, anyways, <laughs> let's get over there. All right, here we are. We have got a chest right over here. Um, this is actually one that I remember seeing, and I am uh, kind of perplexed on how I'm supposed to get that done. So I got a lot of work to do in figuring this out. So <laughs> I guess I'll see you guys in two seconds. I'm going to figure out this puzzle and uh, get back to you. So let's go do that. Let's go do that. that that's going to be fun. I'm actually really excited to find out how to do it. All right, I think I have figured it out. I think I have figured out, that's for sure. I need to walk all the way around with these flames over here, and then I need to shoot it at the uh, at the things. So first off, I need to <laughs> I need to freeze it in air. I need to, oh God, what am I doing here? Oh Jesus, okay, hold on. Let me do this, and then, there we go. Okay, and then I, I gotta jump out, and then I gotta grab it real quick. Where'd it go? Oh, it fell, ah! I gotta give it a few shots because this is the way to do it. This has got to be the way to do it, you know? So, um, let's just keep trying. Let's just keep trying. I'll get it at some point. And, uh, I think, I think this, this is the way. This has to be the way. You know what I mean? Oh my God. I really am a dumbass. I really am a dumbass. I figured it out. This is a much easier way to do it. Why am I? Oh my God. I don't want to fall. <laughs> no. Oh, I really am a dumbass though. I figured it out. I figured out where my error lies. Hold on. Take a look at this. Take a look at this. Ugh, I'm so dumb, dude. Holy. I don't know why I was thinking so... I was thinking, like, way too far outside of the box. There is such an easier manner of unlocking this, like, getting access to this chest. It's so, so much easier. I can just shoot it across this way. I can just shoot it across this way, and I'll be able to see the vines. So, look at this. Look at this. Let's suck in a ball. 
If I can reach him. Jeez. Where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Come on. Can I grab it? I might be a bit far away from them. Here, here we go. Here we go. All right. I got it. Now, take a look at this. Take a look at this. If I just bring it here, I can even just let it float, honestly. But if I just bring it here and I shoot it, it's now... Oh, never mind. It's not safe. Damn it. <laughs> but still, I can I can make it float. We got, we got another attempt anyways. It's fine. We're fine. We're fine. Okay, look at this. Look at this. Let me get it. I suck it up. I then take it. And I bring these flames and I'm going to get it to stay in the air for a moment. So right now, we're going to leave it. All right. And then, bam, we're going to take it. And now, we're not going to uh, have it be destroyed by water. And we can shoot it. See, look at that. I should... Oh! If I... If I... If I... <laughs> if I can land it, I'll be able to do it. So, um... Let's land it. Let's definitely land it. Oh my god, that's so annoying. Alright, we've got attempt number two. We got another shot at it. Is there a place I can land down there? Do I really have to, like, aim it from here? Okay, so what I'm gonna try is aim a little bit up and then fire. Do we land it? Yeah! <laughs> that took so long for me to figure out. I can't believe it took me forever. <laughs> I was thinking we, like, go all the way down to the bridge down there, then shoot at the vines up here by, like, taking it around over here. We, like, take it around this way and then, like, land somehow. I don't know why I was taking, like, so far outside of the box. I was nowhere close. But at least I finally got the last chest in the Tomb of Mictril. Now, we are missing only one more secret. And that secret, I know, is uh, right behind this wall. I remember seeing it. And we just gotta break it down. So let's make our way over there. All right, here we are. So, this is the structure that contains, uh... A force essence, and I think the only way to destroy it is using these spiky creatures. I actually had no clue that these were the things that, you know, you were required to pick up or, or um, like, fling at these boxes. But let's see. I should, therefore, destroy it. Yeah, bam. Look at that. So that was in, in the previous tomb as well, in the tomb of Elram. There was another section just like this with a spiky creature in front of it. So that's the only reason I know how to destroy it. Honestly, I thought these were, you know, going to require a specific force power. But I'm glad that uh, all we need to do is just freaking uh, push those spiky guys in. I'm happy about that. Okay, now we have fully gotten every collectible that is available in the Tomb of McTrill. And we have our maximum life increased. Let's go! They died before the job was finished. Sweet, secret discovered. Look at that, Tomb of McTrill fully explored. Now it is time for us to go. Let's see. I think we are going to be heading over to the Venador Wreckage. Or, wait. Yeah, I think it should be the Venator Wreckage, because we've fully explored everything otherwise. It'll be Venator Wreckage, then Crash Site, and then we are done. Well, I guess Broken Wing as well. So Venator Wreckage, Crash Site, then Broken Wing, and we are completely done. And there's also an achievement tied to the Venador Wreckage, so uh, we're going to make our way through that. It'll be exciting. Let's go. All right, here we are. We're making our way over to the Venador Wreckage right now. We're on this lift. So I don't exactly know uh, how we're supposed to get in there. I did see a collectible right around here. Uh, like physically right around here in this space so we're gonna try and access the area from there but i'm not too sure how to get there yet i'm excited to find out though that's for sure i'm excited to find out so if you see we look out over here and you can actually see a uh, stim crate right over here there's a stim crate right there but the uh, difficult part is actually getting there in the first place how do we do that that's what we gotta figure out <laughs> that's what we gotta figure out right now so let's overcharge this and make our way back up the zip line. Then we'll uh, we'll see what's up. Oh boy, oh we were supposed to stop it. I totally forgot that this is how this one works. So here we go. We've slowed it, and uh, now we're going to be making our way, maybe, to the top of uh, of the structure in here. Hold on. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah, I think we're supposed to actually get over to this section here. Ah, that makes more sense. And you know what? While we have a second, we're gonna go for the achievements. What goes around. So if you recall, I think I did mention it at some point, I was trying to go for this achievement and uh, I was doing it in the completely wrong manner. So what I thought you do is slow the enemy after they shoot their blaster bolt. So like, look at this, look at this. We're going to slow it right about now. Oh, wait, <laughs> one second, one second. We're going to slow it. Oh, what I thought you were supposed to do was like hit the blaster bolt that they shoot out and then deflect it back at them. What you're actually meant to do is take their bolts that they're, you know, shooting, and then suck them into it. Which is a completely backwards way of thinking, if you ask me. So what I'm gonna do is wait for this enemy to, uh, you know, shoot, then we're gonna suck it in. That's basically what you gotta do. And then hopefully, 
you know, you time it right with the actual blaster itself, but that's what you gotta do. I don't have, uh, you know, the force to do it on these pro droids, but that's basically what you gotta do. So for anybody looking to get, get that achievement, that's what you gotta do. I'm gonna try for it with maybe a Stormtrooper, because I know it only takes one hit for them to be taken out. So, yeah. It's unfortunate we gotta wait that long to uh, locate an enemy like that, but hey, whatever. We know we're gonna get that achievement. It shouldn't be extremely difficult, but it can probably be extremely annoying. I've tried a few, I've tried it a few times on the way over here, and I, I messed up multiple times. So, uh, yeah, that's not very fun. And if you take a look, look at all the water in this area. Oh my god, there are gonna be so many collectibles in the water. It's gonna be, uh, it's gonna be a mess getting all the collectibles at the crash site, but hey, you know what? I guess, uh, I guess it's worth it to get to 100%. I guess it is kind of worth it. But I prefer not to do it at all, if I'm being honest. Okay, so, can, can we get you to leave us alone, please? Oh my god, I got two of them shooting me? Jesus. All right, hold on. Let me, let me get these enemies off of me. Come on now. Yeah, can we, can we stop this? I don't even know where I'm supposed to go to actually like climb up here. Is it just double jumping? I think it is. Guys, stop it, please. Shoot me, dude. Just do it. So yeah, I think this right here is the entrance. Yeah, we're just meant to double jump. It looks like we're able to reach it. So that's that's what the game says. If it's yellow, we're able to reach it. So all we gotta do is double jump to make it across, and then we're going to be starting to explore the Venator. Look at that. And then, of course, we have some collectibles in there and whatnot, and we are going to uh, do our best to be very, very thorough. And at the end of it, once we've explored everything, we are going to be unlocking an achievement, which is pretty awesome. Oh, boy. Good thing we uh, didn't go into the right side. God, what's going on here? Are we going to have to shut off the power or something? Oh, jeez, look at this. Do both sides turn on and we have to, like, avoid them? Oh, Jesus, what happened there? I don't even know what happened there. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Oh, wow. I must have gotten damaged by uh, bashing into that thing. I actually lost a lot of health. Holy. Bam. There we go. Wow. Look at this. So we made it into the Venator. Look at that. The Venator wreckage. Wow. All right. Let's head down. Let's see if there are any chests in the murky waters below. I can nearly guarantee there is. Like, come on. There's always going to be chests in the water. So we're making our way to basically the opposite side of where we entered. And we're locating a chest. Very nice. Very, very nice. We've got a meditation spot too. Perfect. Love to see it. And actually, while I'm here, I am going to uh, go ahead and use one of, uh, or two of the skill points that I have available to purchase. Let's see. What shall we purchase? I think I'm going to be in purchasing the Howling Pull. A powerful pull that yanks a group of enemies toward Cal. Hold left trigger and right trigger. Oh, that's pretty cool. That is a pretty cool one. All right. Love to see it. Now, let's continue on. Oh, I didn't rest. What am I doing? What am I doing? I did not rest. I need to make sure I save my location before moving on. Come on now. That's reckless of me. Okay. Okay, let's go. Bam. And we got this guy to deal with. Got even more. Bam. Okay. Ooh. Okay, let's see. Nothing else in the area. We got to make sure BD-1 can scan, so maybe we don't run past these enemies. We take them all out. All right, BD-1, what you, what you want to scan? Nothing at all? Okay. Okay, dude. Uh, make it over here. Yep. And then go up this way. Then go up here. And then go up here. Bam. And we'll hack this one, since it's right in front of us. We'll hack it so we don't got to worry about it. Okay, we can't go down, but we can go across by taking... The walls? How do we get across there? Oh, just jumping. Whoops. <laughs> That's my mistake. Yeah, I don't know how I missed uh, the thing to climb there. I thought I was supposed to, like, jump across. Padawan survived the crash. He was looking for his master and the clone commander. He didn't know they turned. Oh, that's so sad. That's so sad. Holy. Oh, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. God damn, I was trying to lock onto the one in front of us, the one that's an actual threat, you know? <laughs> but the game was like, no, we're looking on we're looking at your ally. Come on, isn't that what you wanted? I lived on a ship like this for years. It became my home. I scrapped them on Braca. Every time it felt like picking at the bones of that life. Thanks, BD. Oh, that's cute. That's pretty cute. Um not the part that Cal was saying, but BD consoling him. That's pretty cute. What is going on here? 
They look disoriented, these enemies. Oh, we gotta deal with you now? Oh boy. Wait, there's someone behind me? What? I couldn't even tell. Alright, let's take out this enemy. Oh, Jesus! Oh, Jesus! God damn. Nice, nicely done. Oh boy. Oh, damn, get- Oh, that was brutal. That was a vicious attack with that uh, dual lightsaber. It's really useful. It's really useful. It, I use it a ton by accident because I'm trying to, uh, like, block and attack at the same time. So LB plus X just uses it, you know? Alright, let's see. Make sure we have that shortcut in case we fall down. And let's continue on. Yeah, overcharge that, please. Thank you very much. So we gotta make it across, and we gotta make it in there. So we have two paths for us to take. We're gonna leave BD doing his thing for a moment while we, uh, check this section over here. Oh, chill, chill, chill. Goddamn. I almost get, got flung off. Oh, what? Why couldn't I use that? It, it, that was such a tease. That was such a tease. I thought I could have, like, blown, it, blown him away. Whoa, what happened there? <laughs> what happened there? <laughs> nice. Alright, at least they're dead. Alright, let's open this. It's locked from the other side, of course. Oh, is that a bounty hunter in there? Yo, come on. Do we actually have to kill a bounty hunter for us to, <laughs> for us to check that area? That's so annoying. Oh, okay, let's kill it. Let's kill it. We're not going to die because we have so many things available to us. We have so so, so many like stims, so much health. Oh, we got two enemies, though. Jesus. Oh, God. Okay. Ooh. Whoa, I killed one. What? What happened there? How did I kill one? Okay, <laughs> I killed one because it hit this. <laughs> I killed it because it hit that. That's hilarious. Yeah, what a dumb enemy, huh? Yo, charge at me, dude. Charge at me. Come on. If it charges at me, I'm able to just let him hit uh, hit the electricity. You know? Come on, dude. Come on, dude. Yeah, here we go. What? This one didn't get hit by it. That's annoying. Okay, maybe I just get some uh, force by attacking, and then we're able to push into it. All right, come on, just a few more attacks. Oh, Jesus. Wow, that, that worked out really well for me, I gotta be honest. Oh, jeez, dude, come on. Nice. All right, here we go, here we go, we got it. So, let's get this one in front of that. Bam, look at that. Easy win. Easy win. I can't believe it. There's more bounty hunters all over the place. Nowhere is safe, man. Nowhere is freaking safe. Okay, so we've got that area to scan. Then we've got uh, the next area. I don't know which way is probably the, the the like place to move on to. I think I'm gonna check out this one first, and then we're gonna go on to uh, check out the next one. Let's see. This is nice. It's it's like a side area for us to investigate in. I actually kind of like this. It's pretty chill. It's pretty chill. I hope you guys don't mind. I know some of you may be uh, anti to get to the story, but this is a full achievement playthrough. Do not forget. You know what you signed up for when you started watching. <laughs> Right? So, we gotta check it all out. Oh boy. Oh boy. Alright, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Bam! Alright, there we go, that's two enemies taken out, and that's the final one. Thank you very much. And then BD wants to scan this thing. That's fair. Alright, let's see what this is. Yeah, let me see. Someone hit here from clones. They were under attack. Yeah, I'm okay. Just brings back memories. Yeah, damn. This is pretty pretty rough to uh, see. Especially that Padawan. He said there was a Padawan that was hiding, looking for his master. That was really sad. Oh, yeah. Must be rough. You can only imagine. All right. So I guess I should have gone down this path right away. And then we should have gone down the uh, next path. That's my mistake. That's my mistake. But, you know, you always got to be thorough. You always got to check things. If you think you're going too far, you can always backtrack. Make sure you get to a point where you can backtrack, you know? You don't want to get stuck going down a ledge that you can't climb back up, right? And that's just my, you know, general philosophy when searching for collectibles and all that good stuff. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? There's a method to the madness. Okay. So we've gotten that taken care of. Now I see that uh, life essence, force essence behind. Very nice. So we're going to make our way over there. I bet you we can just swing that way, huh? Okay, let's go this way. Bam. All right, yeah. We can definitely swing there. All right. Very nice. Get some momentum going. Ooh, I probably could have jumped right there. Just to be safe, we're going to get one more. And bam. 
Nicely done. Alright, sweet. And maybe we can suck it closer. I don't actually think we could. But maybe. Horse essence. Collect one more. Master, what's happened to them? I don't know. There was a transmission. Ugh. You're bleeding. Order 66 executed. Yeah, damn. It's so rough to see. Every time. You're more and more like just bad stuff. It's rough. Okay, good thing we got the shortcut. Damn. Alright, continuing on. Is this an area that we can uh, investigate in? Search? Let's see. There's nothing here? Is this even a platform to land on? It is! Look at that, it is! 69% explored. We're making our way through it. We are almost there. Oh boy. Oh jeez. Alright, let's jump! Nice, love to see it. Okay, we got that stuff to cut. Very nice. Oh boy, chill out, dude. Yeah, you want this? You don't want this. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it so much. It's so good. Okay, let's see. Nice. And nothing else, huh? Oh, careful. Goddamn. No collectibles in this room. Interesting. Yeah, you gotta be thorough. There are always collectibles, like, where you would think they would be, but even though you're being as thorough as possible, they don't put collectibles everywhere, so it's like, you don't want to waste your time, but you also don't want to waste your time by missing them, right? It's a... It's a balance. You gotta find a balance. And that was perfectly timed between those, uh... <laughs> oh, damn. This guy's trying to attack me. But did you see that perfect time jump between those, uh... Those currents? That was freaking awesome. Oh, okay, I gotta heal. Goddamn. Okay. Whoa! Whoa, boy! Chill, chill, chill! Alright. Whoa! Alright, we're gonna- we're gonna force push, that's for sure. Force push them both. See ya! Alright, one looks like it's about to hit it straight up. The other one- Both of them managed to avoid death. They're lucky. Bam! Ooh, that was a good freaking parry. Alright, dude, chill! Chill, everybody, chill! Oh my god, can I- can I- god, god, can I get an attack in? Oh my god, did I just waste my freaking dual lightsaber attack too? My split lightsaber? That's annoying. Oh my god, they're- they're whooping me. These two enemies are just straight up whooping me. I gotta focus on one, probably. Cause I'm- I'm like, trying to hit- hit them both at once. Oh god, come on! <laughs> Leave me be! I'm just trying to fight collectibles! <laughs> what are you guys even doing here? Bam, okay. All right, all right, we almost got it, we almost got it. Yo, dude, 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 dude. All right, nice, nice, nice. Oh, finally, we got just one left, so annoying. All right. Bam, bam, good parry. Oh, take that. Get taken out, and he wants to scan something. Oh, look at that. Very interesting. Gonna continue on. Okay, climb up or down? Just straight up. I guess. Okay. Oh wow, look at this. Those were some annoying enemies. The pairing of those two is just stupid. <laughs> How annoying, huh? Alright. Are you making our way onto this wall here? No. We're just continuing on up. Alright. Sometimes I still wonder how it happened. If there were any signs I missed. Aww. Aw, that's cute. He's he's talking. He's talking about them. Aw. Yeah, I was angry. I still can't make sense of what happened. But I know this. They were pawns. Just like we were. Damn. That's a pretty good way to think of it. You know, he's he's frustrated at them, but they were pawns after all. Master! Marsef, you must go. They're still searching for you. I'm not leaving you. Reunited. Aw. That's nice. That's so sad hearing all these uh, sense echoes. It freaking sucks. Okay, let's see what is over here. Not much, it looks like, honestly. Not much. Oh boy, I thought that was something to jump on. What? Okay. I guess we're just gonna run back this way. There's not much I can see over here. Maybe it's to get back to this location or something. I don't know. 
We'll, we'll use that later. We'll use that later. I think I know what to do. Oh, I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. I can't believe it. I figured it out. Ah, uh, that's annoying, dude. <laughs> All right, do we cut it? Yeah, we do. All right. And then now what? So if the power is still on, now what? Huh? What? What happens? The power's off? Did I just shut off the power? I shut off the power to these, but not to those. Oh, okay, I gotcha, I gotcha. This, this makes sense. Oh boy, that took forever. That took forever. Alright, BD1, just leave the power on, my dude. Okay, don't worry, we're just can- Oh, no! <laughs> I had it perfect. I actually had the solution, I was doing everything right. And then I just fell. God damn. Oh, oh wait, wait, chill, 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 chill. God damn, annoying. Alright, suck it, suck it, suck it. Come on, thank you. Alright, we got it. We got it, God, I feel so dumb. Sometimes, when it comes to the puzzle puzzles in this game, I feel so dumb. Oh, finally made it. I finally made it, and you know what? That's what matters. Oh, now let's continue on. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got. Oh boy, we got some enemies dealing with uh, dealing with this guy over here. All right, yo guys, chill. All right, let's uh, take out this Joe Taz. It should be pretty easy. Let's be honest, Joe Taz are never like overly difficult. Whoa, but they aren't weak. That's for sure. Oh, look at that! We got a chest! Oh, that was nice. That was very, very nice. Alright, does BD1 want to scan something or just slice? Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Oh, look at these chests! We got two of them in here! Oh, and I know what that leads to. Let's go. I'm sorry, Master. His master died in his arms. He buried her the best he could. It was too dangerous to light a pyre. Aww. Aww. That is actually... Oh, that's so tragic. Yeah, don't Jedi always get burned? Oh, that's so sad. You're the best. You're the best. <laughs> oh, yeah, I really like the backstory from these, like, sense echoes and everything. It's really, it's some good stuff. Some great lore, that's for sure. All right, we opened that. Okay, now let's move on to the next one. Wow. Do we just find, like, all of the uh, collectibles in the area now? Like, is that it? Are we done? Nice. All right, what's over here? I know there's definitely something over here for us. Bam! We have fully explored the freaking Venator that's visiting Alderaan places. We explored the crashed Venator that's Alderaan places. You know what I'm saying? Very nice. And now we are getting our stim for this area. Oh, that's awesome. Holy, so we fully explored the Venator. Now we move on to the crash site. Awesome as hell. Sweet. Love it. Love to see it. That's nice. Alright, stim canister acquired. That's nine total by now. Holy. Oh, how are there still more stim canisters across the game? That is crazy. Alright, so we have six chests left in the crash site. I bet you most of them are underwater. We have fully explored the Venator wreckage, so we got nothing to worry about. Now, we're just continuing on. So let's make our way over there, and we're actually going to try and make sure we get that shortcut so we can easily access its area, should we come back here at any point. I honestly don't think we will, though, but uh, we, we should probably get that shortcut since it's there for us to use. Alright, so it should be to the right? Just down here? Yeah, there it is. I, I mean, it's pretty easy to miss, in all fairness, though. So you can't blame me for missing it. Okay, now it's time to do some, some swimming. Let's locate all these chests. I'll see you guys in two seconds once we have our next one. Actually, I'll see you guys in uh, a little bit after this chest. So we've got this one right over here and we got five more to locate. So let's get to it. All right, there's another one. Now let's move on to the next. All right, here we go. We got another one. We've got another collectible at the crash site. Bam, so that is three chests located underwater so far. We are missing three uh, in this area total. So continuing on. All right, we've got another one right over here. It's actually underneath the Joe Taz's platform. That's cool. This one was actually pretty well hidden. I almost uh, just straight up missed it. So that's good. So that's four out of six. Two more. Here we go. That's five out of six. It was actually right near the previous one. And bam, that is the sixth of the uh, collectibles in the crash site. Now it's time for us to head over to the Broken Wing. 
Uh, let's see, let's see. Yeah, right over here. I believe it's right over here, at least. So let's take a look at uh, the Zepho map as a whole and see what we got. I think Zepho should be like 96%. 99, hell yeah, that's awesome. Okay, yeah, so we're missing the Broken Wing, that is it. There is a collectible right over here, and I think that is the last area I need to explore, and that is actually the last chest I need to grab in the entirety of Zepho and in the Broken Wing, which is freaking, like, it's so awesome to say that. I'm so glad we're, we're like, almost done with the collectibles. I am excited to move on to the story. <laughs> to be honest, I am very excited to move on to the story, so, uh, yeah, uh, hopefully we can get to it soon enough. All right, here we are. So, oh, let me take care of this enemy before we do anything else. So, there is actually a collectible right over there. We can see it right now. Um, when I first came through here, I actually missed it. I can't believe I missed it. It's kind of silly that I did miss it, but uh, I was uh, just, like, hardly able to see it. I saw it for, like, a single frame while I was editing, and that's the only reason I know where it is. So, uh, it's kind of silly of me, but now we're finally getting it after so long from our first visit to this location. And let's take care of this freaking uh, annoying security droid, please. Can it just fall in the water? Is that- Yeah, it can! Sweet. <laughs> nice. Alright, so we just overcharge, get this thing spinning, and then we need it to be pointed into this section here. Oh wait, you know what? I'm supposed to end the charge, aren't I? Ugh, oh, I'm so dumb. <laughs> I should just end, end it from spinning, like I should just stop the spinning. Why am I uh, wasting my time trying to freeze it when I can't even, like, physically freeze it? Alright, hold on. Oh! Alright, we got another turn. Let's go! I think that's good. I think right there that is good. Yep, it is. Sweet. Alright, and this is the last collectible in Zepho. Oh, so nice to say that. Alright. Very nice, very, very nice. We're hit! Brace yourselves! There was a battle. The ship went down. Survivors. The attack. Good, wow. All right. So now it is time for us to, uh, I think, you know what? Before we actually do head to Dathomir, I am going to need to head over to, uh, whatchamacallit? Wait, I'm not missing a chest in the Broken Wing. Why is it messing around with me like that? Wait, I am missing a chest. Oh my god, I'm so dumb. It's not the last collectible. <laughs> oh, so annoying. So I need to locate a chest. It is 92% explored and I'm actually missing a single chest, which I think, honestly, if we just give this a shot, I bet you will locate it underwater. I can't believe I just didn't think about it like that. I got a freaking sense echo and not even a, uh, not even a chest. I knew I needed a chest. That's the thing. BD1, you good? You good? You just chilling? Just chilling, my dude? Wow. Looks, uh, looks pretty dope. I didn't know you could use the force, my guy. God damn, that's awesome. <laughs> you still there? Oh, boy. Alright. Is he stuck? He hasn't, he hasn't appeared on my back yet. No, now he has. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Can I get underwater over here? If I can, I can, uh, check for the collectible probably in this hole right here. Perfect. Alright, there we go. I think after this we'll have fully explored Zepho. It's just, you know, a tiny crack. It's a tiny crack that I was missing. But it's good. It's good. We at least got, uh, got the last chest on Zepho, which means we have, you know, collected every single chest on the planet. Let's see if, uh, that's all we gotta do now and we can finally go. And <laughs> I can stop making these, uh, silly mistakes, you know? Alright. Let's push that. Let's kill this guy. Bam. I think, uh, yeah, they're both dead. Nice. All right, there we go. Broken Wing is explored. Zepho is entirely explored. And we have found all of the chests, all of the secrets. Oh, we're completely done on Zepho. Now let's take a look at the other planets. We have completed Zepho. We have not completed Dathomir. We have completed Bogano. We have completed Kashyyyk. And we are missing only one tiny small area in Ilum, which honestly I should go ahead and take care of. So before we do make it to Dathomir, I'm going to have to go over to Ilum. And we're going to need to uh, go ahead and search that entirely before we make it back to Dathomir. All right, so I'll see you guys in two seconds. Let's get on it. All right, here it is. I've located it. There is a sense echo right down there. I finally located it. Oh my god, this took so long. <laughs> oh boy, here we are. Bam. We have acquired the final sense echo on Ilum, and that is fully explored. She was so scared of failing. Brings back some memories. There we go! Oh my god. So we've got Ilum fully explored, and we have also gotten Bogano, 
Kashyyyk, and Zephyl fully explored. Now all that's left is Dathomir. I don't know if there are any other planets in this game. I, uh, I've managed to avoid finding that information out. I bet you there will be one more for the story, but we've done a fantastic job. We are almost done every planet that is currently available to us. And once we arrive at Dathomir, we are going to crush the collectibles there as well. Oh, I'm so excited. All right, let's head over to Dathomir. I'll see you guys in two seconds. All right, we are back on the ship. I must admit, once again, this is another recording session. I have split this recording, this whole video, over like three different days, which has been, uh, it's been confusing, that's for sure. I keep forgetting where I left off. But we are going to quickly go ahead and plant what plants that we do have, like all the seeds that we do have. And uh, if we take a look, I think we're missing two seeds only. And um, unfortunately, I did look up a, uh, a list and I know which ones I'm missing. They were on planets that I have already cleared out. So it looks like I'm going to need to head back to Bogano and I'm going to need to head back to, I think, Zeppo or maybe Kashyyyk. I can't really recall which one, but for now, we are going to leave that for a separate video because, my God, I've collected enough collectibles for quite some time, if I'm being honest. So right now we're going to head over to Dathomir and continue on with the story. So let's make our way over there. Since we have everything we need for the story, I'm freaking excited to see what happens with uh, Dathomir. I may try to get collectibles on the way, but I'm in no rush. I faced him. Yes, you're ready to face your past. What about you and Trilla? I don't know if I'll ever be ready. You know what you need to do to start healing, and I'm so proud of you for that. I have my own path. I'm here for you if you need me. That was nice. That was really nice of Cal. What the hell? I'm glad, like, they patched things up. I was kind of afraid that they would be at odds for, like, a bit longer, but it's good that they're good. They're on good terms now, you know? Are we going to start traveling? That was a really short conversation. I'm surprised. Here we go. We are back on Dathomir. It's been so long. Holy. Look at that. Dathomir. Here we are. Ooh. I'm excited. I'm excited to see what's up. We're going to kick the Wanderer's ass. I forget what his name is, if I'm being honest. <laughs> I think it's like Taco something. I don't remember what his name is. It has a T in it. I can't remember that much. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Yes, Grease. We will be fine. Okay, and actually before we go, what I want to do, I feel like the Mantis has been yellow for uh, a long time. Let's give it a different paint job. We have every single paint job available. That's pretty cool. Uh, let's give it... Ooh, I kind of dig that. I kind of dig this as well. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, you know what? The black one. I'm, I'm kind of digging that one. And then BD1 could also use a fresh paint job. Maybe we'll give him something a bit cheerier. Uh, no. That's too cheery. <laughs> I like this one. This one's fresh. This one feels minty. You know what I mean? And let me get rid of my poncho. I don't want to wear a poncho right now. Uh, where do I go to it? Customization poncho. Let's, uh, just go to outfit. Can I just, like... How do I get rid of poncho? Just that? I guess that is how I get rid of it. Okay, sweet. So now we got our jacket back on. Oh boy. We have got a lot to take care of on Dathomir, that is for sure. Wow. Okay, uh, so our objective is... It's gotta be right back at uh, the tomb, right? Yeah. The tomb of Kujet. We gotta go all the way back there. Alright, sweet. Oh yeah, new objective. When I moved a single inch, there was a new objective added to the hollow map. So let's see, yeah, it's in the tomb of Kujet, as I figured. Okay, all right. Can I actually climb this over here? I, I prefer this this way of uh, getting over there if possible. Yeah, sweet, I can. I get to avoid all, all the monsters on the way. Great. Okay. Ooh, man, it's nice to be back here and actually do stuff for the story. I've been so sucked into collectibles lately. I, I just, you know, haven't really thought about the story. <laughs> I'm, I'm very excited to see what happens. And we are definitely avoiding all the Night Sisters on our way. That is a lot of spiders! Why are there so many spiders? Oh my god! That was a ton! I've never seen that many spiders before, holy. Okay, let's keep going. Here we are. Alright, we got some more Night Sisters to deal with. We're just gonna run past them. Did, did they attack the Night Brothers, or are the Night Brothers safe? Because the Night Brothers currently work with uh, the Wanderer, right? So, I'd assume they're not friendly with Night Sisters. Seems like the Night Sisters completely cleared out all Night Brothers. They made this place very dangerous. Oh, damn. I forgot they jumped. Jesus, chill. Is it still chasing me? I hope not. Oh, wow. Okay. Here we are, Tomb of Kujet. Is it finally time? <laughs> Is it finally time to uh, see what's up with the tomb? Make our way in there? Holy. It's actually 
It's actually so nice to be back. It's been forever. <laughs> Let's go. Oh my god. Let's see what's up. I should meditate first before we get in there, though. Just so we can save our location. And then we'll see what's up with the Tomb of Kujet. Do I have any skill points? Should I, uh... Get any skills? Ooh, I do. Sweet. I have two skill points from all those damn collectibles. I have a ton of skill points. Um, there are two skills I can purchase. I'm only missing four skills total. Let's go. What I think I'm actually going to do is wait until we get three skill points. Yeah, so there's a lightsaber mastery I can purchase, but one I really, really want that I think will be super beneficial is the power of friendship to refill my force meter when I use a stim canister. So I think I'm going to, you know, save up one more skill point and then get the power of friendship. Which, first of all, is an awesome ass name. Second of all, it's an awesome ass skill because we're gonna, you know, refill the force meter every time we heal, which is gonna be awesome. It's just gonna be so useful. And we have so, so much health. We have so many stim canisters. We are decked out. We are ready to go. We're gonna crush the tomb of Kujet. Let's see what's up. Are we finally interacting with this? Are we gonna unlock a new power? I wonder what we're gonna get here. I'm actually very curious about this. Master. You were wrong to return here unarmed. Not unarmed. You think that lightsaber proves you were Jedi? No. Chasing you. Memories that have haunted me since Braca. I won't run from them anymore. Yeah, Cal. Then let us see what manner of death your courage brings. Damn, yo. Okay. All right, we got this. Purple. Oh my god. Look at this. It's so damn good. I, I don't have a health bar. Interesting. Okay. We got this. Ooh, scary. This is this is a scary fight. Bam. Oh, split attack. Oh, are they are they recommending that we use the dual lightsabers? That's pretty cool. Wow. Oh, what's this? What's going on? Oh, I love this. Damn, Cal. Oh my god. I will never forget. The loss has become a part of me. Holy shit. I will honor your teaching. And your sacrifice. Wow. Remember, persistence reveals the path. Damn. God damn. That was so awesome. Good for Cal. Good for Cal. He's becoming a true Jedi. Oh boy, we got Night Brothers to deal with now. Oh, chill, guys. Chill. All right, guys, 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 come on. Damn, they cannot handle this, this split saber. That's actually awesome. All right, come on, come on, dude. All right, can, can I hit this guy? Ah! Oh my god, I'm gonna take a lot of damage. Jesus. Hey, chill, chill, chill. Okay, let's take this guy out. Please, 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 let's take this one out. <laughs> Bam. Oh my god. It's it's just like the setup of the Knight Brother and the and the Archer, you know? It's like the ranged and the close is definitely interrupting me to a great degree. Let's just focus on one, maybe. Maybe if I do that. Oh, I didn't want to use a split saber. I just wasted it. Damn. Whatever. Alright, let's just kill this one. Bam. You got a few more shots in you. Oh, whoa! Chill. I can suck him in if I wanted, but nah. We're good. We're good. Okay, sweet. Look at that. And we're moving deeper in. Into the tomb of Kujet. Okay. Wow. Look at that. This has got to be the last tomb, right? We're finding an ashram in here. It's got to be the last tomb. Is this a fight? Yo, no way. You chose to return. Brave. But not wise. Maybe. Marin, right? I'm Cal Kestis. What you were told about the Jedi was not true. So you say, Cal. 
Malikos said many things, too. Terra Malikos might have been part of my order, but what he is now, I... I have no idea. All I do know is having a lightsaber isn't what makes you a Jedi. Damn, good for you, Cal. Then what does? We were peacekeepers. We were betrayed by those we protected. Hunted down by the Empire, I... I might be one of the last of my kind. I was only a child when they attacked. An armored warrior brandishing this descended upon us and cut down my people, my sisters, until I was left alone with the dead. Then Malikos came and promised me revenge if I shared our secrets with him in return. I know what it's like to lose everything. And Malikos was wrong to use that against you. We don't have to be enemies. Okay. We will need this. There she goes again. I'll be watching. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Manikos lies ahead. You could turn back. I can't. Lives are at stake. Whose lives? Innocents. Four sensitive children who will be hunted down and murdered. As we were. My friend, I have never been one to shy away from the pursuit of knowledge. Wow. Oh boy. Alright, so we're about to face Terran Malikos, aren't we? Look at him over there. Yeah, we're we're about to get in a fight. Oh damn. Oh, I'm not I'm not climbing there yet. I saw a side path. I'm gonna go there first. But she wants us to fight him. Oh, we're gonna take him down, that's for sure. I should probably go to the meditation spot though. Is there a meditation spot in here or is it that just a, a sand psycho? Yeah, it looks like that's all it is. Pick it up. Something terrible happened here. A massacre. They killed their own kind. Promises of power. Okay. Ooh. Burial place. Damn. Alright, so we're definitely gonna get in a get in a fight with this guy, right? And I just got a skill point, which means I can acquire the uh, skill which allows me to heal my or no, which allows me to uh, refill my force meter when I heal. So we're gonna get that, and then we're gonna go right back to him, and then we're gonna crush him. I think we got this. I think we got this. I have so many stim canisters. I have so many skills overall. I think we got this. I just got to get past the Knight Brothers. Hopefully they don't damage me too much. And then we are going to defeat Terran Malikos. I thought his name was Taco for some reason. It was very similar to Taco. If you you got to be honest. It, there's the T in there and there's the Ko. It's like, it makes sense why I thought his name was like Taco or something. <laughs> you know? <laughs> okay. All right, sweet. I'm very excited. This is the fight. Terran Malikos. You're gonna get whooped. Uh, is there any way for me to avoid these guys? Do I have to fight them? Uh, oh wow, there's a path over here. I, I didn't even see this path before. Let me, let me, let me go up this first. Let me see what collectibles lie here. Alright, come on. Annoying ass. Let's see. What we got? Got another sense echo, eh? Okay. Alright, what else? We've got just this path over here. Are we going to get behind the archer? Bam, he got hit real well there. I'm going to try and get an achievement while we're while we have this archer isolated. This, this is actually a pretty good chance to get it now that I think about it. All right, let's go ahead and bam and then bam. Oh, I didn't kill him, though, but I did damage him. Did you see that? I did damage him, which is pretty good. OK, I think one more shot and he's dead. All right, chill, 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 chill. Wait, you know what? I can heal and I can refill my force. We got it. We got it. We got it. All right, come on, dude. Shoot. Shoot, shoot, shoot. What are you doing? Why aren't you shooting me? Where are you headed? <laughs> Bro, come on. Come on. Do it. No, 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 no. Oh. All right, come on, come on. All right, here we go. Bam. Did I kill him? Oh, there it is. What goes around? 
Defeat an enemy with their own slowed blaster bolts. Holy, it took me forever to unlock that achievement, but I finally did it. Holy. This man has promised to grant us our vengeance, but only if I teach him our magic. Forgive me. I must ally with Malikos. Damn, poor Marin. Okay, sweet. So we finally got that achievement. This entire video, I've been trying to work on that achievement. I have failed like countless times. I probably didn't even show you guys every single attempt, but I failed so much. And I finally got it. That is awesome. That is awesome. What goes around has been unlocked. Ooh. And now we are going to defeat Terran Malikos. Sorry for that uh, detour. I just want to take care of that uh, before we continued on. I just noticed that side path. So, you know, it just worked out that way. Oh, sweet. And it, it was so beneficial for me to have just unlocked the ability to refill my force meter just by healing. It's so useful for that achievement specifically. So that's dope. That is pretty dope. Now it's time for Terran Malikos. Oh my God. Wow, this has been a long video. We're finally getting into the story for this video. I hope you guys are excited. Alcestis, Malikos, welcome home. You to begin your training. What in these ruins tempts you so much to risk death? I could ask you the same thing. There is power there. Beyond Jedi understanding. Power I control. I would offer you the same thing. Don't you understand? I'm not interested in power. I want to restore the order. Restore the Jedi order. Oh, you poor fool. It's over. Jedi fell long before the purge. It was stifled by tradition. Deafened by our past glories. Blinded by endless war. Maybe, but it's never over, Malikos. We stand here now, with the chance to learn, to rebuild from our mistakes. Jedi learn. There's no future for them. Why can you not see that? It's time for something new. You and me. We could build something different. Something better. No. Dathomir will be your grave. Oh, damn. Whew. All right, let's go. It's time. Terran Malakos, you will die. Oh, damn, I got a good hit in there. Oh, and he's getting a few good hits in on me. God damn. And that was a pretty decent parry as well. Oh, this guy's got some powers, eh? Oh. All right, I, I can't suck and I can't push just like our master. Wow, but I can. That does actually sort of break down his stamina a bit, which is good to know. Oh, all right. Come at me, Terran. You're gonna die. Whoa! Nicely done. I love that attack. Too bad it didn't do too much to him, but that's all good. Ooh! Oh, ho, ho. look at that. So good. All right. Oh, we got this. Damn. Chill, chill, chill. Whoa! That was a good block on my part. Holy. Goddamn, 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 no! <laughs> This is really exciting. God damn. Oh my god, I'm loving this. And he's such a badass, like, enemy to face with those red lightsabers. Oh my god, we're actually- it's basically a Sith, isn't it? It's like not even an Inquisitor at this point. Or, although, I don't know what he exactly is, but wow. This is- this is a, an enemy that is, like, worthy of being one of the last enemies we face. Holy. But the second sister, we are definitely gonna beat Trilla up so goddamn hard. I know it. I'm looking forward to it. This guy is just training for Trilla, you know? Oh my god, he's getting whooped! Holy! Damn, bro, I'm sorry about that. Oh! Damn! Yeah, you can force push too, I see. Is that lightsaber gonna, like, come attack us? Oh, it is! Oh, did you see it? He pulled it in. That was cool as hell. Ooh. Damn, 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 damn! Chill, chill, chill! Alright, get hit! Whoa! That is such a good attack, holy! It's like he didn't see it coming. Oh, damn, I wasted it. I wasted it, no! Oh, whoa! All right, come on, come at me. Damn. Oh, holy, so cool. Oh, oh, oh! Heal, heal, heal. Yeah, we got this. Bam! Oh my God, that split saber—it destroys his stamina. It actually just destroys everything. Holy, it's such useful attack. I'm so glad we have it now. 
Oh, oh damn, what's going on here? Oh! Holy. Yeah, let's go, Cal. That is so cool. Holy shit. That is so cool. Uh oh. was wrong to think you could stand with me. No way. Holy. You have no right to stop the mirror. No right to our magic. Get up, Calcastus. You're not dead yet. Damn. Thank you, Night Sister Marin. That was so good. Holy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Goddamn. Whoa. Yeah, you're a quick one too. God damn, this guy's this guy's insane. I'm so glad we have these health upgrades. Holy, we are getting hammered here. <laughs> yeah, I would love to finish it. I gotta heal first. Oh, holy. Oh damn. Oh my god. I could I could have force pushed it or or uh you know done something about that. God damn. Alright, dude, 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 chill out. Oh, 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 oh god damn. Oh, Jesus. I'm about to die! <laughs> Holy, I hardly got got that healing in, in time. Oh, damn, that was an unblockable attack. Shit. Oh. Yo, let me heal. I don't even have a chance to heal before he attacks me. Oh my god. Nice, nicely done. You split saber. Oh, he dodged me. No. Okay, okay. Alright, we're getting ready. Push it. God damn, how am I supposed to push it? How am I supposed to push it? <laughs> Dodge it. And split saber attack? No, I didn't even get my split saber attack. And yo, I'm actually getting whooped here. This this got real hard all of a sudden. Oh, that was a good push. I didn't know you could get affected by it too. Ooh, yeah, get hit. Ah, no. So if he's charging at me, he won't be able to to block my uh my force pushes. Ah, look at that. Yeah, he's actually getting affected by it this time. That is really good. Oh hell yeah. Get hit. Get hit. Get hit. No. Damn, dude. All right, let's see if I can slow it. No, I can't. Oh, chill, chill, chill. I can probably slow it. That's probably like the best method for uh, hitting it back at him if I slow it beforehand. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Whoa. All right, come on, dude. Come at me. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Damn, let's go. The force push actually destroys him. Look at that. It gets rid of all of his stamina. That's insane. Okay, whoa. <laughs> This guy's a scary enemy. Okay, okay. All right. All right. Perfect timing. I got uh, my force back. And then we're gonna... Oh, dude, you're kidding me. Oh. All right. Slow. And then go ahead and... Bam. I should have been using slow during this fight, honestly. It's actually super, super useful. Whoa. All right, let's hit him. Oh, he blocked my slow? What a dickhead, huh? Oh. Damn, dude. Yeah, hit him! Let's go! Nice, love to see it. Love to see it. We're gonna get a split saber attack in, that's for sure. Ooh, that was a good parry. Whoa! <laughs> All right. Don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me. Oh, wow, okay, okay. Oh, here we go. A split saber. Oh, that was such a good freaking attack. Look at this. Look at this. He's dead, he's dead, he's dead. Oh my god. Hell yeah, we did it. Yeah, let's go. It's like you said, Malikos. Dothamir will be your grave. Damn. Oh. That was insane. Holy, that was awesome. Let him lie in the dark with his secrets until death takes him. Why'd you help me? To rid Dothamir of that parasite. Damn. Oh, I knew he was no good. Defeated a former Jedi Master. Terran Malikos has been defeated. Oh, holy. Oh my god, you know what? How, how much farther do we have in uh, the Tomb of Kujet? Oh, honestly, if it's right there, we're going to continue on. We're going to continue on. We're going to finish up the Tomb of Kujet. Let's, uh, let's, of course, heal before anything else. That's probably a uh, pretty important thing to do. We'll heal, and then we'll make it deeper into the Tomb of Kujet. Hopefully, we are going to be retrieving an Astrium. That would be uh, pretty awesome. Okay, 
Let's see what's up with you, Night Sister Marin. What are you really doing here, Cal Kestis? The ones who built this tomb, the Zepho, they created an object called the Astrium. It opens a vault on a distant planet. Inside is a list of four sensitive children across the galaxy. But the Empire is looking for it too. What Empire? The Empire. The one bent on exterminating Force sensitives so no one can stand against it? Then it will come for Dothamir before long, as the war did. I will help you find this Astrium. Thank you. That's nice. Sweet. This place, it's horrifying. Horrifying, yeah. Horrifying indeed. Ooh. Wow, look at this. This is this is the scariest tomb so far. Wow. Look at this. The design of the tomb is fantastic, though. Can we be honest? Look at that. Oh, wow. Is that it? Is that actually the Astrium? Yo. No way, man. Oh, hell yeah. It's so exciting. Yeah, look at this. Yo. Oh my god, hell yeah. Oh, that's awesome. It is real. Baron, this could be the key to the next generation of Jedi. I'm happy for you. And your Jedi. But nothing can bring back my people. Damn. Very true. After the purge, I was alone for a, a long time. In hiding, I was, I was scared that they'd find out who I was or what I was. What changed? A very good friend of mine told me to go out and find my place in the galaxy. And you listened? Well, no. Life has this funny way of forcing you on the path forward anyway. Now here I am. Or at least expected. A path forward. I will join you. Oh! Yo! You will? I've spent years waiting for a chance to avenge my sisters. I'm finished waiting. I wish to fight by your side. Night Sisters and Jedi do not travel together, but survivors. We adapt. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, I guess we do. What do you think, BD? Yeah. I agree. That's so awesome. My crew, they might take a little bit of convincing, though. Then we'll convince them. Wow. I was not expecting this. For her to join the crew? I was not expecting that at all. That's so cool. Full house, what? Full house? Recruited all possible crew members for the Mantis. Interesting. That's so interesting. Oh my god. You know what? L look at the image. Look at the image. I'll put it up on screen right now. Look at that image. You see the 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 person that is on the right side? I don't know if that's necessarily a person, but that's that's the boggling. Oh my god. So I was wondering what this was. Back back I don't even know when. We were in Bogano and there was this hidden area where we used force push to open up this like little section and it freed a boggling and it said we had a, you know, boggling ally or boggling friend, something like that. And that's what that was. So to get full house, you need to free the boggling and then continue on with the story. That's so cool. I actually didn't know what to do for this achievement. I was wondering this entire time. But hey, I'm glad we got that done. That is freaking awesome. That is so, so awesome. We, we got like three achievements in this one video. That is awesome. Oh, wait, maybe we got more because we got some collectibles. I honestly can't remember how many achievements we got. I think four, maybe five. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But we, we made a ton of progress in this video and we're not stopping anytime soon. But in this video, we are done for now. So I do hope that you enjoyed the video. If you did, please do consider dropping a like. And if you did enjoy the content enough, please do consider sticking around and subscribing. 
because we are going to be continuing on with this game, unlocking all the achievements, and we've got many more games to come. So definitely stick around and subscribe for that. All right, anyways, thank you so much for watching. Once again, I do hope you enjoyed. I'm looking forward to the next part. We are so, so close to completing this game, and I hope you're looking forward to it as well. All right, take care and have a great day.